What's up guys, it's your favorite Kiwi coach and give me six months of your time, I'll give you the best golf swing of your life. Whoa! So welcome back to the channel. I'm actually joined here today with Hero, one of our clients who's been working on his golf swing. Shot 78 yesterday. So Hero, why don't you maybe quickly introduce yourself if you want, and then we'll start the lesson. Hiro to いますえ、ゴルフ始めて4年目でキウイさんに教わるのは大体今2年目になります。え、最近ではほんとにゴルフに真面目に取り組んでいて、え、あの、キウイさんからいろいろなあのスイングに関することを学んでいる最中。Ok
when we're trying to hit the draw, we want the club head to go out, mm -hmm. not the hands to go out. Because when the hands try to go out, people try to start to get the whole body to help. Mm -hmm. So they tilt a lot and everything goes out this way versus when the club head goes out, that means the grip in is going in and that typically will shoot the club head out while the body does not want to tilt as much. Mm -hmm. But all right, one more. And then we're gonna go down to probably P2. Right. All right, P3.5. Very good. All right, I'm gonna support the body now. All right, E, G, N, E, S, T, N. There you go. How do you feel there? I was a solid contact and my rotation was, was better than the one before. All right, so now let's film that. We have the, uh, Kazuki's oh, filming, didn't. so we. <laughs> <I> just, <laughs> I'm back to the tripping. old days where it's just me, just me, no cameraman, right? Yep. So same image here. So timing, we're mm -hmm. having that little bit of patience and transition right when the hands get around, lead arm parallel. Mm -hmm. Let's get the move. Sure. All right, let's see it. You said P2? Yep. E. Chini san. Oh, that was quite good though. I don't think perfect mechanics, but strike was quite good. 1.4 smash. I was really patient <laughs> with that transition. I think the transition was great that time. Mm. Oh, really good. See how we can see a little bit of about half of your left leg. Mm. It looked like the chest stayed completely closed from almost P4 to P5. Yeah. And then from here, now we just start to rip. Club head pitches out. And then churn. A little bit of neck tail tail, but not so bad. Mm -hmm. So let's take a look at that overall. That's oh, good. That's quite a good move. Yeah. Okay. What do we got time wise? Yeah, we still got a little bit more time to work on the irons. I think mm -hmm. we're in a pretty good spot now drop with my chest and shoulders closed p5 keep them on with oh yeah. and left tilt and drop no rotation mm -hmm. then keep the angle that you created and churn and basically just feel like you keep the angle forever it's kind of the <laughs> yeah i think i think your uncle called it like the swivel or something like that the that's whoosh move that's what he, he was calling it oh the whoosh move the whoosh move <laughs> I was like, what are, you, what are you talking about? <laughs> we got the wrapping. Wrapping. <laughs> Tell me, we gotta get your uncle on a golf magazine. <laughs> Those terms would kill it there. I think people love it. So that's it for you guys on YouTube. But before you guys kick off, let me give you some quick wrap up points. When it comes to the overall lesson with Hero, there's a few main points we're always driving home with them. Typically, we're getting very, very narrow early, and then we're trying to actually raise the hands, raise the handle, and get that cricket type release, which just makes it very difficult to point the face where we want to and get the low point where we want to. So for Hero, to make it quite simple, we always talk about patience in transition, which is all about that width idea that we talked about, keeping the chest closed, and then after you have the patience move, then start to rotate much more level through the ball and don't allow the shoulders to tilt, right? So that's kind of the wrap up. A lot of you guys have similar issues, so I think if you guys watch this video plenty of times, share it to your friends, you should pick up value in it every single time because we went over a lot of points. I know it was a lot of information, but make sure to watch it plenty of times. Other than that, make sure to check out the membership site. It really does help support this channel. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share all that good stuff, and I'll see you guys in the next video.